Here's what your doctor should have told you about what sleep apnea is really doing to your body and why it's so damaging, which is important because it allows us to stop this damage. And I have some deep sea divers to help prove that. So we're told that sleep apnea is bad because you stop breathing at night, right? But that's only half the truth. The real threat is that your body cannot handle big swings in oxygen. So for instance, take free divers. They're people who just like literally go underwater, no gear, like minimal gear, and they hold your breath for a long time. And when they go out and do that, they do that like, you know, five, 10 times per session. So those free divers are all relatively healthy because they can handle those big swings in oxygen levels at a cellular level. So if you work on how your cells respond to oxygen going all over the place, you can do better at night. So top three ways to offset this, make sure you talk to your doctor about this. Number one is CoQ10. Number two is high intake of polyphenols diet or supplement. And number three are slow breathing exercises to improve hypoxia resiliency. Now the breathing is the most important. If you wanna get a custom step-by-step -step plan for that, you can go ahead and click this big old red button here or click the shop button or go to the website over my face.